What is up guys and welcome back to Fudge Muppet. This is the Sniper Part 2 and this is the guide on how to get you from level 2 to level 30. So here we go. Let's dump a bunch into guns straight away. And straight off the bat, I'd say let's get intense training so we can buff up our perception. So we'll get that to 8. Always helps for our accuracy and it also gives us some cool perks. We'll get guns to 50. And what we'll do is we'll get sneak up a good amount. We'll get sneak. You might want to do a little more focus on medicine and survival earlier on, but uh, I don't. But the only other one we'd want really is survival. And we, the only reason we want to get that high is because we want the walker instinct perk, which is really, really useful. Educated. It's just a pretty essential perk for any character with more than four intelligence. So we may as well get that. So you basically have a better leveled character overall. Now let's do some survival again. Yep. And we'll get sneak to 50. And we'll bump up our repair. Now what are our choices? What about... Yeah, so once again we'll go intense training. And we'll put our agility to 8. So we're getting our... A perception and agility higher so uh, we want to get them to about nine through intense training so once we have walker instinct effective uh, we'll have 10 perception and agility as well and you also get the bonuses from that from gear like hats and stuff gives us more perception the beret I'm pretty sure gives bonus perception um, hmm or you could wear sunglasses if you liked uh, repair to 50 and we'll put survival to 50 as well. Um, hmm. Get, uh, better get guns up as fast as possible. So now we have options of all of these and we do want to take none of them because instead we want more intense training. Uh, let's do agility so we get more, you know, helps our gun and sneak while it's still low, so get a few more points to our gun and sneak. See, we got boosted by two points in either of those. So we'll get that to 70. Um, we'll get... We'll put a bunch into survival this level. And then we'll get that to 70. So we've... Once we do get to the ability to get Walker Instinct, we can get it straight away. And we should probably start investing in repair so we get jury rigging. Well, so we can get jury rigging by the time we need it. And level 14. Uh, finesse. Finesse at level 10 is a very important perk because we've already got 10 luck. Get that 5% extra chance that finesse gives us. Stacks on top. We'll be getting criticals left, right, and center. Okay, let's get repair up some more this level. Um, perhaps some guns, actually. Get that guns to 85. Now, what do we have? What do we have to choose from? Alertness would be a pretty cool perk if we already didn't have such high metabolism. So if you differ a little bit, you could do that. Now we want sniper because we want uh, we want to be able to get headshots because we're a professional, you know. So our VATS headshots has increased. It's a 25% chance, uh, more chance to hit the head. Uh, let's... Let's um, get that repair up, because next level, we'll get full that into repair. We need to get our sneak up, it's falling behind. But now we can get jury rigging, and we'll get jury rigging before light step, because you still can avoid traps if you're, if you're you know, keen-eyed. So we'll get repair, that's a pretty essential perk. It's great for any character, really, and we've used it for pretty much all our characters anyway. Alright, get our sneak up to par. We'll just fix that to 80. And then we'll get some more into guns. So we've basically done guns. Hmm. What to pick now? Now, weapon handling. If you think it's very necessary and you've got the anti-material rifle right this second, that's the only reason you'd really need this perk. But if you're not going to use anti-material rifle, don't even bother with it. But uh, better criticals is what I'm going to go for because that's the 50% more critical damage. And we get lots of critical hits because we're all based around luck and we've got finesse and all our critical, uh, all our gear's got critical chance extra. So we, we want that because we basically uh, 
gives us a lot more effectiveness. Uh, let's do sneak again. Do some sneak, sure. Why not? And then we'll start getting our repair up. Uh, let's have a look down the bottom. Now, Walker Instincts, level 18. Oh, we didn't even need survival that high. Well, there you go. You don't have to get it that high. But, you know, role-playing, especially if you're playing on hardcore, uh, and, you know, you want those um, speech options with survival, that's cool too. So, Walker Instincts, now we get plus one perception and agility when outside. Uh, so, so, we've got our guns, we've got our repair, we've got our sneak. Uh, we better start going into some medicine, just so we'd be able to heal your character. You guys might want to do it differently, because you might want some of the minor skills earlier on, depending on the difficulty you're playing on, or your just personal preference. This is just a very general guide to get you up there. So, uh, what have we got? Well, we have a choice of all of these. This light step is an essential perk. But what we'll do, we'll get... Because, you know, he's, he's good at avoiding traps. He's a real behind enemy lines character, the sniper. What we'll do, we'll get the fourth level of intense training. And we'll bump up our perception to nine. So now, when outside, we automatically have ten um, perception and agility. So, we're a pretty tough character at the moment. We, uh, we see all and shoot all. There we go. We're getting our medicine right up there. So... Now, 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 now. Uh, we better get out onto our light step. Yep, light step. Get medicine up. Yep. And we'll continue to get medicine up. And then our survival. Now, we'll have a little cruise through the perk list. What have we got? Now, you can sort of pick some interesting ones if you're playing survival. Uh, home on the range is a really cool one. Interacting with campfires and sleeping, and like sort of you know that real role playing sort of getting out there behind enemy lines and then sleeping while you're traveling to your target. But let's get um, weapon handling, I think, because we'll want to be able to handle a anti-material rifle. Because we already got our um, we got better criticals, we got sniper, we got Walker instinct, we got light step. And I think that was about it. We've got all the essential perks so far. So now, we've got to assign one more point to something else. I would probably pick something like lockpick. That's just my preference. Just, you know, something else, another sort of helpful skill. Once you sort of end up having this many. Um, okay. I'm just going to quickly go through, make sure I haven't missed anything. So we got our... I think we got all, we've got all our, our main ones. Look at this. Nerves of Steel, that's a good one. Regenerating action points. Uh, tunnel Runner, that's another really neat one. You can um, run while sneaking a lot better. So a lot faster. Oh no, actually it's not because we're in medium armor. Disregard that. Nerves of Steel, let's do that. Get our lock pick up. Get our lock pick up again. Eeh, there's, so what do we have now? Silent running would be a nice one, center of mass if you were going to do a lot of torso in vats, but uh, I probably wouldn't. Roughing it is another cool one, um, going under, carrying a bed with you. So let's do silent running. Get lock pick up again, and then get lock pick up again. That's just another sort of optional thing. You can really put the last skills into whatever you want, and between level 30 and 50, it's all up to you. So we definitely got all our uh, we, we got all our necessary stuff. So just we'll just check the level 30 perks, see if there's any cool ones. No, they're all level 28, all that kind of stuff. So let's do um, home on the range. There we go, just for role playing. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, that was how to level up to level 30 with the sniper character. I hope you all enjoyed, and uh, I'll see you all next time. This has been Scott, and uh, 
check out our social links descriptions, blah, all that. The stats are in the description below, along with all the links to our social media. Follow them, we use them, we love you. Thank you very much, have a good day.